Hey Lenny's and Bunny lovers, welcome back. So today I'm gonna be visiting shelter bunnies and giving them a lot of fun goodies, feeding them banana, bringing them supplies, toys, treats, all that stuff. And I just wanna remind you that all of the bunnies featured today are up for adoption at North Central Animal Shelter. And if you don't live in LA, you can always give your local shelter a call and see if there are any bunnies available in honor of what we're doing today. Hopefully this inspires you. So let's get to this. That's so sweet. And he's a big bunny guy, and he shows me linen videos. Aww. But yeah, he's got two buns that live in his room, and he's a huge fan. That's amazing. So I have so to get a sweet. photo. Of course, you. of course. Hello. Aww. Oh, you like, you like head pads. You like them too? When I come to volunteer, my mission is that every rabbit will get out for at least an hour. People think of rabbits like small animals, but rabbits are generally as big as cats. Mm -hmm. And you wouldn't keep your cat in a cage all the time. They're yeah. extremely active, physical yeah. animals. So mm -hmm. that's my personal mission is that every bunny gets out once a week. <laughs> Aww. It's great that you have all this space for that though. We have full rooms at every shelter. Absolutely overflowing with rabbits, guinea pigs, and hamsters. And it's the room that gets the least attention, the least number of volunteers. And honestly, these animals are lucky if they get out once a week. So if there's anyone out there that wants to join our volunteer team, you can pick the shelter that's closest to your neighborhood. And I can guarantee you every single one of those shelters is in desperate need of a small animal volunteer. So the truth is that he's currently my favorite bunny at the shelter. He's absolutely stunning. You know, look at, he has these little like, leopard print ears and the black eyeliner and he says i'm so shy because i've never had a life outside the shelter i can't believe it i know he came in when he was only one month old oh my gosh and now he's like five months i can't believe nobody's adopted him we just don't get foot traffic here mm -hmm. nobody comes in to look for rabbits or guinea pigs or hamsters we're lucky if once a week someone comes in for a bunny and there's 30 bunnies. You know, there's nothing more important than spay and neutering a bunny. We have people who have dropped off a hundred bunnies. They bought the two bunnies from someplace. They were not neutered. And in one year, two turned into a hundred. There are a couple of vets in the LA area that provide very low cost spay neuter that are subsidized by the city with low cost vouchers. So reach out to us. If it's something you wanna do but you haven't been able to find an affordable vet, they are out there. All right, we're gonna give the bunnies all their awesome toys and treats and then we're gonna feed them banana. Would you like some? 